And we we're live. live. We're keeping it real with the Millers. I'm Monica. I'm Morgan. And we too happy for it to be a morning morning show. Morning. I can't even talk. <laughs> I'm happy, but I can't talk. <laughs> All right. So, we live and nobody's here. That's how it goes, right? Morning ones are going to be like this, right? It's just going to be me and you. Yeah. I just want to make sure that it's working. Yep. Okay. It's working. We got one viewer. They're hiding. Probably grandma or something. It's probably grandma. It's probably Cedric. Like, what are they doing going live? <laughs> um, sorry, getting some Bella. Yeah. I love Bella's name. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. whoa! Things are popping up. <laughs> it's crazy. Craziness is happening on the computer. <laughs> Like, what do you got me doing this early in the morning? <clears throat> All right, so here's our plan. Our plan is we have two Shop Goodwill boxes that came, and we're just hanging out. We should be doing other things, <laughs> but we're like, hey, we're going on vacation. We leave, well, it's like a mini vacation. Two days. In a couple days. So we're like, we got to do a video before we go. We can't like not do a live. We have six views. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> of course, I have nothing to drink. And my voice is about to go. <laughs> <clears throat> How rude of me to be like coughing into the mic. Yeah. <laughs> um. So that's kind of our plan. Um, I do want to, at, right before we're coming live, um, another kind of uh, reseller. She's also been on as one of our subscribers and watched us. And so she just messaged us. And she's from Minnesota. Um, oh, what? Jackie's alive again. Jackie says, I'm alive again, but I'm still Still editing a video from a week ago, so I'm going to be quiet. Yeah, right. Hi, Sarah and Jackie. <laughs> we missed you guys. We love you. Oh, my gosh. This is going to be horrible. If this is going to be my voice. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. So I just want to say I, I said I would give her a, not a shout out. That's like the worst thing. Um, Hi, Deb. That's Deb. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like there's no Deb there. Um, <laughs> yeah, sexy voice. I know that, but okay. <laughs> so anyways, on a more serious note, um, so this viewer, like I said, lives in Minnesota. They are further away from, from us, but there was a death of, or not a death, sorry. There was a fire. See, it's too, <laughs> don't ask me to do this stuff. Like it's too early. A fire. Um, there was a fire. And um, it's a bad situation, and this family lost, it looks like, everything. Um, and it's just so sad, like, just heartbreaking, right? It's right before Christmas, and to have that. Um, but the family's in need, and um, they have started a GoFundMe page to help kind of raise some money um, to help this family kind of get back on their feet. Like, I can't even imagine what it, like, especially in Minnesota, to understand, like, we have snow already. It is cold. Um, they lost everything. Yeah, okay, Deb can tell more. <laughs> Deb, I hope I'm getting this all right. So maybe you can write more and I can repeat what you want me to say. But um, I just, in Minnesota and anywhere, but especially in Minnesota, I cannot imagine at this time, losing your house we a couple of years ago oh almost lost our house due to a fire um my dad's car caught on fire and it we ha i mean we almost lost our house we had fire damage we were so lucky um god definitely stepped in um but i remember i wasn't even home i was very far so i, I just can't imagine what that would have been like um, so Deb says 30 years in the same house with all the memories of the kids growing up there. So they lost like everything. They've lived in this house for 30 years and they just lost everything. Um, it also sounds like this family was a giver, like they would always donate. So in our area, food shelves, like homelessness is huge and in, in, in everywhere. 
um, but it becomes an issue here because it gets so cold. So food shelves are so helpful in our communities. It sounds like this family was really giving and giving back to the community and trying to help out. And so, um, you know, this is the time of giving. And sometimes we forget that at this time because we want, right? We have our Christmas list and we want all these things. Um, and sometimes we forget that sometimes it's a, that other people don't, aren't blessed the way that some of us are that we can, you know, receive or give. Um, okay, she just said they started the Trinity mission in St. Paul and only gave no no used not used to taking. They're not used so they're one of those people, like you've met these people, right? Where they give and they give and they give. And then like if you give them even like a small little gift, like here's a little gift, right? Like they don't know how to t how like, to have you met those people? Yeah, mom. like my mom. My mom is that way. Like she's a giver. She gives all the time to us, to everybody. She will do I mean, she'll meet a stranger in the store and like we'll have to wait for her to go and like, you know, make their day or help them in any type of way. That's just who some of these people are. They just have those hers. But then when you want to give them a gift or help them, like they don't know how to receive it. You really have to kind of like, here <laughs> you go. Um, and so that is like, sounds like how these people are. So I am going to, I don't have it right now, but she gave me, Deb gave me the link. Um, for their for the GoFundMe, I'm gonna put that down below. If you can get five dollars, like five dollars plus five dollars is ten dollars, which adds up. So you know, if you can give any little amount to help this family, I would greatly appreciate it. Um, I know that they would. Um, Deb said I even packed up the food bags and packed the Christmas list for all of the families. Yeah. So that's a huge, I think it happens all over from how, from what I hear, but you know, um, is where these places, they, on top of giving out food bags and then they do like holiday food bags. So like for your holiday, they'll give out like Thanksgiving. I know up here, like they do these, like you get the turkey and you get the stuffing and you get all these things. And I remember mm -hmm. us being at a place where we used to have to do that yeah. and it was amazing. Or at Christmas time when we were struggling, like I remember going and not knowing how I was going to get her presents and I could go to some of these um, agencies and they would help provide gifts so that we could, do, you know, have gifts. And so um, that sounds like what the, this organization that they um, started this Trinity Missions, which of course you can research and know it's for real. Um, so please, set, you know, prayers for this family. Um, and also just, you know, if you can help out, great. So I will, once we're done going live, leave the link down below. Um, and of course, wish everybody a happy holidays. So, all right, that's my oh, kind of disheartening. Oh, that's so sad. Makes me so sad. But we have to now move on to why we're live. Yep. Do you have anything to say? No. So I also want to... Carol! <laughs> Carol, do you see what happens to this face when she sees your name? I just want, do you see this glow that kind of happens around this face once you, oh, and, and you get a little dimples, oh, and the dimples come out for Carol. Princess Casserole is here. Oh, Sarah. Sarah? Oh, they have different names now? What is happening here? All right. Is that everybody? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, sorry. We had to do a couple of things. Everybody blue. Everybody. Everybody blue. 
All right, let's see here. Carla, oh geez, here I go again. Hello, I've got 15 minutes before a meeting. Sorry, I missed that. You'll have to let me know later. Yeah, rewatch it. Um, like I said, I'll have the link down below where you can help this family um, for the GoFundMe. Pay, um, and like I said, I know it's also Christmas time and holidays. The money can be tight, but $5, you guys, just $5. That's all I'm asking. Um, let's see. No, she said that's because we're friends. <laughs> no, it's because you're her, like, special person, right? <laughs> right. You're, you're her happy like, we all have, like, happy places, mm -hmm. and then you have happy people, right? Right. And Carol's your happy person, right? Right. Yep. And Ollie's. Like, let's not forget, like, if Olive can hear Carol's voice, she's like, bam. Bam. Where is she? Where's Carol? <laughs> so funny. Oh, they did it so you know which one's Sarah and which one's Jackie. <laughs> that's That's a good idea, though. Oh, okay. What else are we missing? Tip of the day, Nordstrom Racks is having a big sale. All right. So if you have a Nordstrom Rack near you, go check them out. You can um, watch Carol. You can learn. Um, she does a lot of retail arbitrage from them. We don't have one anywhere near us. I think the closest one would be the cities. I don't think I've ever stepped inside of a Nordstrom Rack. Um, but Carol did a couple hauls from them, and they do have some cute stuff. So. But my question is, do they have plus size stuff? Because my fate, one of my fate, well, not here because ours is kind of chancy, but Kohl's has some nice plus size stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, Diane, oh, how, are, how is she not a moderator? Never are you the moderator. <laughs> She's been with us forever. Uh oh. Uh oh. Carol's near <laughs> the old H Mart. I need Carol, do they got those? Did you see how the so Heather and Dwayne, I didn't tell you this. What? They did they opened your package last night. So you have to watch the video. Okay. Um Carol, I think you were there when they opened it. Um oh they do have plus size. We have one, but it's snowing. I'm not leaving the house until you have to. I understand that. But they also got another package from Rolling Pickers mom sorry you guys it's gonna be one of those days and she got these hello kitty sunglasses they were so cute so i'm wondering where she got those from I'm wondering if h mart would have those yes the hello kitty sunglasses but you're gonna have to watch hello he hello heather heathers see i have nothing to drink i i had manly voice it's all going downhill and we're gonna be live for a while this is not a good start heather's reaction mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So, if you didn't check that out, Morgan did a special surprise artwork for Heather. Dwayne reached out to Morgan and sent her a picture and said, can you do something with this? So, then Morgan did something with that and then added a little twist of something that Heather <laughs> loved. And I think it turned out amazing. So, yeah. go check out Dwayne and Heather on Mothership Products um, channel. Um, they did a little unboxing, and you can see Morgan's latest art project. It's amazing. On top of, Morgan is now starting her own business where if you would like an artwork from Morgan, you let her know what you like, and she does it in an anime style, and I think they turn out amazing. She's very talented, um, and it's $25, and that is shipped, and we ship it very nicely, and you can actually see how we ship it um, because when Heather opens it, it shows how we actually it, we ship it very nice, um, but yeah, it was great. It was great, so go check it out. If you are interested, you can email us at keepingitrealwiththemillers.com. Mm -hmm. Or wait, keeping it real with the millers at gmail.com. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. It's down below, you guys. It's down below. <laughs> Carol's leaving. She's going into H Mart. Cool. <laughs> I don't know where she's going. <laughs> Morgan's like, oh, yay. Oh, I have to get a cat for my hubby for his birthday after the holidays. Yeah. But, yep. She loves to draw cats, too. <laughs> We'd have to. 
So all you have to do is like tell us some of your favorite things, favorite colors, color, favorite like anime, or you know if you like cats. Like I don't know if you saw Dwayne's, but we knew Dwayne liked cheese and bacon, and so she created this thing. It, you know, so that's how it is. We find out what your favorite colors are, so we make sure it's you know or what colors you would like in it, and so that's how it goes. All right, so moving on. This is like. <laughs> We're already into this how many minutes, you guys? I don't even know. Does it even tell us anymore how long we've been live? I don't think so. I don't think so. <gasps> Dwayne! Dwayne! Crazy people! Reseller Mafia for life! I think we need to get some shirts. We might I have to take a picture done. $25, and that includes shipping. Yep. And the picture's on a little bit bigger than a 8 by 10 It's on watercolor paper, right? Right. <clears throat> so it's on really nice paper. Yeah. And we, she has some blogs. 16. <laughs> 25, Dwayne. What are you talking about, 16? She has some vlogs of what they look, you know, kind of her process and what they look like. What's 16? Oh, so we've been on for 16 minutes. Mm -hmm. It's been a long day. Can you see that? Yeah. So Dwayne just said, thank you so much, Morgan. Excellent. We're totally impressed. I need to get a picture of the cat they saved on the fire yesterday. Send us a picture. That's for the family. Mm -hmm. Oh, yay! The cat was saved though. Yay! Good. All right, here we go. <laughs> so, shop goodwill. Goodwill. Which one is this? This came from the one in Florida. Florida. I have to go take one. Okay. Yeah, take one. Yeah, I guess they, unless they have one on their phone. Um, I know, I just figured it out, Dwayne. <laughs> it's early. It's so early. Let's see what it is. All right, let's see. Oh, not going to be your favorite. Ladies brooches. So it's a lot of two pounds of ladies brooches and pins. Okay, we're going to go through this. Yep. We paid how much? $9.99. For the auction, and then with shipping and handling, the total came to twenty four sixty one. Woohoo! She's becoming a pro. All right, so this is how they package it. Now every place is different. Yeah, whatever works for you. We will. We can do that, right, Mark? Mm -hmm. All right. So much paper. Yeah, I mean, I do wish that they would like figure out shipping a little bit better because this is it. I don't think there's any more. So that's a big, huge box full of paper, full of paper for this little thing that they could have like. How much was shipping? Eleven sixty-two. Yeah, I mean they could have put this in a um, padded flat rate. Jewelry. Oh my! So that's what it looks like. All right. So I'm gonna give you that. And we can put them in there. Okay. So I don't like to. I like to put them in a cleaner bag. I don't know why. I guess this one's not bad. We could use this. You know, it's got a hole in it. There's some cute ones in there, though. All right. Josiah. Hi, Morgan. Hey. Or, hi, Monica. Hey, Morgan. Hi. Hi. Are you, you supposed to, have you been on before? That name seems new, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Josiah. Is, am I saying it right? I think so. I like that name. I like that name. Morgan likes that name too. Yeah, I saw that. You've seen it before? No, it's his 
Green's Instagram post for me. He um said, I love you, Morgan. Oh, Dwayne made Morgan blush. <laughs> Red cheeks <laughs> happening here. Little tears. Oh. Chris is here. Chris. We just want to, like, I just want to say, you know, we make jokes about how this show, when you once you come into the show, you become a part of the reseller mafia because you become family when you come to the show. But, um, oh, cool, he's new. Did I say your name right? Cool, did you? Oh, I'm going to mess that. From Arizona, awesome. You got the nice weather. <laughs> but um, we love you guys so much all right i'm excited there's some cute things in here i'm just gonna pick one i like <laughs> well i don't know if i like this is a duck key it looks like it does. doesn't it looks like a bird some type of bird okay so it's gonna be uh, it has one of those type of um clips where it clips like that but i don't see any signature on it Gotta go meeting time. Bye, Carla. Bye. You're gonna miss out. There's gonna be some cute stuff in here for your hubby. <laughs> oh, this one's cute. Are you gonna pick some too? You're just gonna be me. This is cute. A little dolphin. <laughs> I read one. <laughs> oh, Carla. Carla. Look what we found. And its head moves. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's so cute. There's no markings on him, though, that I can see. I'll have to look at him better. I love him. Look at that. Did not mean to embarrass you. <laughs> I don't think you did. I think she was touched. Yeah. Were you embarrassed? No. I think it, you know, sometimes when you're having, when you just having a down week, right, Mar? Mm -hmm. And I know that there's people out there who do love you, and she was really. Be truthful, really right. nervous. Yeah. She was really nervous that you and Heather weren't going to like it. Yeah. So. All right. Andy! <laughs> yes, you're saying Josiah, right? I am a girl with a boy's name. Well, I love that name. So you rock it. I think it's a cool name. Cool. I'm at the gym, but can watch a bit here and there. It's all pins. Yes. That cat pin was awesome, right? Thank Aww. you, Angie. Angie's another one of our favorite people. And they do have some markings, a few of these, So, but I'm going to have to look at them later. But this is a little Scotty dog. Isn't that the cutest? There's some little, like, that one is so cute. There's some good ones in here. I think these are some giraffes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> me to help it, you. It, oh, okay. Then you just put it in there and close, close it. it. Yeah. Some giraffe. That one's kind of cute, too. Mm -hmm. There's some cute ones. Should I just show them? Or you want to show them? See if they're open like that? Mm -hmm. And before mm -hmm. I show it, just so. Them, and then that's what I hold on to. Okay. I'm teaching her how to show you guys jewelry. That one's cute. Let me see if there's. Looks like there might be some stones missing. Yep. So this will be like for crafting. I don't know how to fix stones. I might try. I don't know how. Oh, the critters. Yes, there's lots of that. It's like that's all that's in here is critters. It's kind of awesome. Yeah. So excited. Butterfly. And I can't believe like nobody. Honestly, I was the only one bidding on this lot. I couldn't believe it. And there's a lot of, of Carla's gonna have to watch this later because there are a lot of cat pins in here, you guys. This one is can't mm -hmm. read. I'm gonna see if if Angie can read it, but look at this one. Oh, that one's cute. That one's so cute. But can you see? Yeah, see. Screw Pope. It's like screw. Pope. Screw Pope. <laughs> Chipotle. Mm. You can see the items. Good, 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 good. Unique, unique, so unique, 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 unique. 
Oh, look at this bird one, Angie. That's like a hummingbird. That one's really cute. I love hummingbirds. I know. I hope it's really good, too. I'm really nervous. Because I it looked good from the pictures. That's how I do it. I think but I honestly, Angie, I didn't look at it. No, oh, it starts with an S. I think it's an alligator. Oh, that one's cute. I want this closed. I went the wrong way. Oh, it's pretty. It is pretty. Is that? No, I don't. See any stones? Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, I think there's some stones mm -hmm. missing. Right there. That's so cute. And then, oh, this one's cool. Look at this one's wood. That's a big wood yeah. fish. I know I love the hummingbird. It's so cute. This one's interesting though. It's like hand painted. Poodle. Let me see that. Oh. No, who loves poodles? No, um, Dawn. She's not here though. That's a cute poodle. She collects them. <gasps> Look at this cat pin. Oh, it's broken. Oh, bummer. It's a cute cat pin, but it's broken. Look at that. This part's broken. I don't even know how you would fix it. I don't know if I can even fix it. I don't think I can. But that is so cute. I mean, have to, and it's marked. And it's marked. Come on now. It's a JJ. JJ, but it's broken. Got this bird pin. Whoa. Close it. Close it. Ooh, what's this? <gasps> it's weird. Here. You want me to help you? I'm not helping unless you ask me to. Here, I don't know how to close that one. Here, so this one's really cool. Make sure you show the back. Is this, what is it? Cobra. Snake. Cobra. And the back came looks like this. From the front again. From the front. You don't show like it very long. And then show the sides where that's like, fuck. Like fake pearls. From the front again. I was <laughs> choked on a Twizzler. <laughs> Because of why? Because <laughs> you want to chew your food? <laughs> you can turn your junk jewelry into some good money. I sell a 15 pound box for 89. Oh, that's cool. I know I'm starting a lot. Like I have like where it's like crafter stuff. So I do have that. Okay. Then this is the one she was. This looks like an eagle. I'm trying to make sure. I think it's missing some stones though, but that looks like an eagle to me. It looks like it's missing some stones. Don't eat a Twizzler and talk on the phone. Nope, that's not a good idea. If you have one that's open, you can't get. Just tell me, and I can get. It. Did you get it? No. See, it goes like this. I'm gonna show you. So you gotta go underneath. Mm -hmm. Make sure it's open. See, and then you bring it down like that. Oh. Okay, cool. This is a cute one. Like a two tone cat. And then this is, it has a marking on it. I'm just going to show them. Okay. Okay. Can you see that marking? Maybe I should do. I've never done it this way, right? With this thing. Maybe marking. Can you guys see that marking? I don't know what that is. Sweet job, Morgan's mom, a great teacher. I'm on these machines texting instead of lifting. <laughs> that was Angie said that. Is this a cat pin? Oh, that one's cute. Looks like a tiny. It does. Is there a marking on that one? No. That one's so. cute. That one's cute though. I got a teacher instead of just do it for her, right? You've learned a lot. And then it makes her get into this type of jewelry. Look at that lizard one. That one's cool. Look at more. It's a salamander, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. I did one. 
See? Good job. A fishy. What is that? A, a fishy? Fish. That one's kind of cute, though. Is there any works on that one? Oh, look at this one. Oh, that one's so cool. I'm just looking to make sure. I'm looking. This one is so. I don't see any marks on it, but look at that one. That one's cool. That one's so cool. I like the animal, like the pins. I really like them. Bird. Any markings on that one? Nope. Think so. I don't think so. That's all right. I can always look. It's just if you find one that, you know, like some of them you can really see. Sometimes the markings on them you got to really go and look at for them. Chris said, I'm lifting candy. Ha ha. Does that count? Margo! I'll come for Margo and Monica. I always do. <laughs> I always like scream their names at them. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Who's first? You do okay. yours because I'm going to look at the silly little owl. He's cute. <laughs> does he have a mark? Nope. I don't think this guy does either. Maybe <laughs> way down there. This is a fly, but look at the detail of the different stones. I think it's a fly. What do you guys think? Fly or beetle. Are you going to resell them? Yep. So we, I, not we, I wish she'd help me on that. Um, but we have an eBay business. And so our link to our store is down below if you ever want to show us some love. <laughs> Um, but so, yeah, so we buy stuff from shop goodwill and then we go through it and then like, like I've shown you some of the pieces that are missing rhinestones and stuff. Those ones we won't sell, we'll put in a crafter slot. Um, and then we sell it. But if there's ever a piece that you would love to buy, you can email us and our email address is down below. Um, and we can send send you an invoice um, and you, we don't have to list it um, and let us know what piece you're interested in. And that's on any of our videos. If we still have the items, um, we will sell it to you. And um, yeah, then we don't have to go through eBay either. So let me know. The owl was great. Okay. Sorry. I think it's a moth. I think it's, I hope it's a butterfly. Who do I want to think of a moth? Oh, it's Mother of Pearl. Can you see that? It's like Mother of Pearl. The thing just popped open and scared me. <laughs> Hopefully it'd be a... That was a weird... It like popped right open, didn't it? Yeah. You got to get it way up in there. All right. All right, I think we got it now. <laughs> got your back. You looking for markings too? Yeah. Oh, Morgan, look at. Oh, it's a koala. Morgan, I hate Andy. Hi, Monica and Morgan. So glad to see you guys so early in the morning. I know it's kind of fun, right? We don't usually do this. We're always later. That was great. Oh my, that's a high end piece. The fly looks like, I don't know. I know I couldn't see the marking. I gotta, I'll have to take time with the loop and go look at them. But if I do that, she gets bored real quick yeah. <laughs> and she's into it right now. Uh, yep. Same with Angie's treasure, you know, all of ours. Um, Josiah, if you want to um, subscribe, Angie has a channel. Almost everybody in here does. We all have stores. We're all resellers. Um, Angie has some amazing jewelry, and she sells on Etsy, though. Um, but Angie has some amazing, amazing stuff. So um, if you're watching after the live, go check out Treasured Vintage um, page. I'm going to leave the link down below her YouTube page, um, and she has a link to her uh, Etsy shop. But she gets some amazing yeah. stuff. Amazing. I just... I can't say, it, but blown away. yeah, I got blown away. She, and she's great to work with. She's reasonable price. I bought some things from her. And so 
Okay, so on this one we paid. Morgan, do you want to do that? Yeah. She, she wants to know how much we paid. Yep, and how much it was. Do you want to read the titles to her again? Um, it was a lot of two pounds of lady brooches and pins, and the price was nine ninety nine plus shipping, and the grand total was twenty four sixty one. So twenty four sixty one. What do you find? Okay, so this pin, I just wanted to show, but this piece is broken. See that? And I don't think that you can fix it. It is a marked piece, though. Andy, tell me if I'm wrong, but I don't think, I think once that's, it's Morgan's favorite, so it's not super, but it is a cat pin. It's Avon. This little cat pin, but it, that piece is broken. Oh, she watches you? Oh, that's awesome. And it gets some amazing pieces. Yeah, I will. There's some nice pieces. I, you guys, nobody bid on this lot. I was the only one who bid on it. Lion one. That one's cool. There's no marking on that one, huh? Nope. I'm surprised how many of these don't have markings. But I might have to go in and really, really look. Oh, this is a cute giraffe. Look at that. Even the eye has a little rhinestone in it. Andy, I don't say diamond anymore. <laughs> got a little rhinestone. That one's cute. That's got some weight on it, too. Yeah. Okay. okay. Just pick a different one. Some of them are harder. We won't get discouraged, okay? Let's pick one. Oh, this one's cool. Mm -hmm. This one. It feels a little cool right there. So this has like a meshy. I believe there's one mark on that one. That one's cool. See, I closed this and now I gotta open it. What type of dog is this? Wish Carla was here. She'd laugh at me. Let me see. This is a butterfly. And it is a Monet. And Carla says um, Monet and Sarah Covington and Avon pieces are drawn to me. So <laughs> that's why I said I wish she was here. But that's a cute piece. <laughs> Bless my heart in a good way. Okay, so let's see. We're missing stuff in the chat. You need help with that one? So Dwayne is back. <laughs> Jackie says, my great uncle passed away a couple of years ago. And when we were looking at some of his stuff, he left me. And we found a, we found two 14 karat gold, gold necklaces. And they weigh... A total of 36.85 grams. Wow. wow. Sorry about your uncle, but dang. And I, I don't know where is gold good right now? Where gold prices are. Okay, let me see if I can get those clothes. Scottish Terrier. We like those. We used to have a dog. I don't know what kind of dog this is. This is Okay, now this is an interesting piece because look, it could be for so this. Look at this, enam. So it's enamel, but I think he's missing a foot. Yep. Oh, bummer. So he's missing a foot, but he could also be like for um, a necklace. That's a bummer. He's missing a foot. He's a three legged I could could I sell him as a three legged dog? Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, What is that a bee? Yep. A bee. Oh that's cute. No markings? Mm. You're not checking. Um AFJ. I don't know what AFJ is. Oh, bummer. I might try to sell him as a three-legged dog and see where <laughs> I get. Look at this owl, Mark. Look at it. It's like teal. That's pretty. 
and then the, it's got no markings on it that I can see, but that's the back. That's really cool. This beetle. Okay, now this is not feeling so well made. Like it's got a cheaper feel to it, but it's really cute. There's a lion. You see, it's kind of hollow, hollow out. Macaw. That's cool. Oh, I might have to keep this one. Ooh, that one's pretty. I love this one because I love butterflies, and then it's all pink. This one I might have to keep if my mom don't steal it. So I always let her look first. Another one of these beetles. But that's what I want to get an uh frame and do something so that I can stick my pins that I get from people in there. Oh look at this one. Is this a cheetah? Mark? Um I think so. I think that's a cheetah. Um Angie. I'm wondering if you, Jackie, if you guys should go to a jeweler. <laughs> Dwayne. Um, I don't know if Andy's in here. Dragonfly pin. I can give him a deal on the price because of the dog. Well, you know, some people have three-legged dogs, and maybe they would love a pin that, like, represented their three-legged dog. I know a cat that only has two legs. Right, see? Guys, yeah, sometimes we got to think. It's the most adorable cat ever. <laughs> Is that a parrot? parrot? Rat on a cracker. That's cool. There's some cool ones in here. And there's still more. <laughs> We're, we're closing them, the thing, so we don't get poked. <laughs> Look at this little donkey. Is it a donkey or a little horse? I think it's a donkey. Looks like a donkey to me. So here's a question. Andy, are you in here? Or is she working out? <laughs> or if we can find it first. Oh, loving all of these. I know I'm loving these too. If you can find what first. I think I missed something. <laughs> She's telling Dwayne to put her, his address in the chat. <laughs> Does this mean you're going to start a new thing? Break break. Oh, my. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, no. <laughs> That would take some work. This cool alligator one. So, Andy, when you see backings like this, see how it has the square? Does that mean anything? Like, as far as, does that tell you anything as far as age? Because I see a lot of them don't have that, but I do find some that have this, like, square right here. Does that, would that tell anybody who about the age of it or the quality of it or anything. I just have always kind of wondered that. This cool bird one. Ooh, that's cool. Morgan, look away. Yeah. This is a frog. <laughs> An enamel frog. You might like it. You want to see it? Sure. Are you sure? I don't want to freak you out. I so don't if you want don't... to see it. Okay. <laughs> There one. I was trying to see if Andy answered me. Lion. Is that like a dove piece? Mm -hmm. Is that like a dove bird with a holly leaf on it? <laughs> what is this? I have to see this. <laughs> What would this be? I have no clue. So it's like a spider. 
Oh, it's a pin. So it's like a bug. And those are the legs. So what are our favorite animals? What are our favorite animals? Yeah. What like, is? If it was a wild animal, I have to go with Siberian um, tiger. And if it's like a regular, regular <laughs> animal, I gotta go with cat. <laughs> um. Okay, my favorite animal. I love cats. And I love little tiny fluffy dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I think a Pomeranian would be oh my really God, cute. Those so cute. They're evil. <laughs> uh, and then, like, wild animals. Like, if it wouldn't kill me. An ostrich. <laughs> <laughs> not an ostrich. Oh, my gosh. Um, I like panthers. Like, I like the way panthers look. They're so cool. Um, but my favorite, favorite animal, or, like, it's not even an animal. It's a bug. It's an insect, <laughs> but um, our butterflies and monarchs are my favorite. I got attacked by one. <laughs> so that's what this thing looks like, and that's how the legs are, which are interesting, but it is a pin. That's interesting. I've never seen one like that. Is this bug? Did Andy ever answer me? No, but I do think that probably indicates an older piece. Okay, the square. All right, great. That's what I was wondering, that too. Wait. Patsy! Dwayne, how can you hate cats? Dwayne, we're not, we're not doing this with the cat thing again. You, like, it, we're done. It, it, <laughs> I don't understand. Angie! How can you... So this piece is in, is really cool. So it has like the spun um, metal in there. You see that? It's really simple. This cool Cute. dragonfly one. Oh, I was like, what the heck is this thing? <laughs> Wait till you see it. Wait till you see. Funny one. Oh my gosh. So I just saw this, <laughs> and I was like, what the heck? Look at this. It's a polar bear on top of a f fake pearl. That's cute. Oh my God, this thing's creepy. What are they saying? They're talking about what they like. I hate, to, okay. I got a fluffy Siberian husky. They're fluff. They I mean, fluff everywhere. Yeah, and that's too big for me. I am not. Love eagles, love the wild horses. Panthers are awesome too. I love eagles. Like every time we see, well, in part in Native American culture, eagles are good luck. But we see a lot of them. Yeah. We've gotten to see them like up close, like sitting on the road. They are huge. They're the most gorgeous. And I'm always pointing them out. We used to live by one too. Mm -hmm. There used to be a nest. But it got knocked down by the storm. When the babies were in there. But we used to always go watch it. So we love eagles too. So sorry. Wolves. Morgan loves wolves. I love wolves. Wild horses. Panthers are awesome too. Some are cute, but they are all kind of look the same. Not our cats. You would be surprised. Angie, what about you? Any particular bird? Deb said, Angie, you had two dogs at one time that looked like twins. <laughs> yeah, right? Angie loves and all birds. <laughs> what did I remember about birds? We're talking about what our favorite animals are. We're wondering what your favorite bird is, Angie. Angie's puppies, uh, though, are so cute. <laughs> Don's here. Hi, Don. Oh, find the poodle in there for her. Uh, I can't. <laughs> There's a frog in there, though. The frog's not going to hurt you. Don, we got. I got to show you something. Yeah, I pretty much love all birds except maybe buzzards. That's Cedric likes buzzards. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta find it, Don. Um, I gotta show you something here. Down here. So what? It just disappeared. Oh, you got poke? I got poke. Something came open. Right there. Where? 
Right here? Yeah. Um, here. What are they saying? Um, they're saying, oh, trouble in the hair, hair out there. I know they did. Oh, uh, they don't know. Just got, just got Another, here. Just the wife don't go all look on me now. How can I find it? Here it is. Here. Found it. Oh, here. oh wait, you dropped one. Did you sh we showed that one, right? No, I think oh. so. You don't think so? No. Yeah. Done! Don, can you see this? It's a poodle. It's a pink poodle. Everybody say hi to Jackie and Sarah so they know we all love them. <laughs> Isn't that cute? I had to show that to Don loves poodles. Okay, moving on. Okay. Tell us when you're off, Angie. Angie's working out. <laughs> this creepy looking dog pin with red eyes. I swear. This thing says eat. Does that not say eat? E-A-T? Oh, There's this fish, which is cool. But I swear, I don't know if you guys can see that, but I swear, like, right there, it says eat, E-A-T. <laughs> that's funny. Like, eat the fish? <laughs> Lizard. Oh, that's cute. Don't you like poodles, Don? I swear it was oh, you. The pearl that went whoosh, whoosh. Where? Right there. Came from something. Mm -hmm. A little snail. Oh, this is cool. I think it's broken though. This was a. Can you get it? Yep. This was a swordfish out of Mother of Pearl, but it broke right there. Butterfly. Don threatened for you. She's saying hi to everybody. <laughs> oh, we took care of that situation. I think there's some pearls from this thing missing. This peacock is really cute. But I think there's a couple of pearls missing. So that one I might try to fix. Myself. I can do pearls. I've done those before. That one's cute though. So if I can, like, it looks like one of the pearls is in here. We'll see. Okay, look away more. Yeah. So this is like a ceramic frog. Marin's deathly afraid <laughs> yeah. of frogs, but. Okay. Look, look away. No, not another one. There's another frog. <laughs> There's... What are you doing? I was looking to see if it was Mark. <laughs> All right, I'm looking to make sure there's no more frogs. Yeah. Okay, I think we're good. Yeah. Oh, but I found a really cute cat. Look at that. Oh, that's cute. And this little cat. Yeah, I have my Mongo biker friend. <laughs> okay, I'm not reading that. Marco, how do you feel about selling ivory? We're not allowed to sell ivory. Um... Uh, so it's from my understanding. Like I've never found ivory, but from my understanding, it's against the law. Like you're not allowed to sell it on eBay or anywhere. I don't think you can sell it anywhere. I don't even know. Like, would you get in trouble if you sold it like at a flea market or whatever? I don't know. Oh, I mean, I don't feel like people should. 
That is a cool cheetah. Um, that one. <laughs> oh, yeah. I found another frog. I thought I looked good. So then there's another frog. Let's try to see if it's my. Um, I don't believe in hurting animals for that. But I know there's some vintage pieces. So it makes me wonder, like, what happens to those then, too. I don't know. What's ugly? What's wrong with frogs? And what about toads? Well, uh, I'm not crazy. Uh, you're talking about. Who's ugly? Um, Morgan's definitely afraid of frogs. I've been scared of them ever since I was little because, like, this frog <laughs> kept hopping towards me. And it was dark out. And, Ma and Mom and Grandma were playing groceries away. And I was screaming and crying. <laughs> I'm like, hold me. I don't <laughs> want that thing coming after me. Oh, she's trying no, to make I'm me like, sound like I'm a horrible parent. <laughs> <laughs> How there's still some more. This is cool. I'm going to be looking for more of these. Oh, they're cool. That one's cool. This one's really pretty. Let me see. I love the bird ones. They have so much detail. Yeah, I mean, it's not allowed to be sold, and I don't really agree. I mean, I've never found a piece, but I don't think animals should be abused. Or no. This one I think is missing, which is too bad. Missing some of the stones. So has anybody ever sold ones like pieces like this where it's still in really good condition but missing a few of the stones? Like maybe I could just sell a lot of them. Oh, the oh and the trunks up. So somebody who was it was um Diane. No zombie. No makeup zombie. Yeah. Um, she was she, in her videos. She's a good person. She doesn't resell, but I know she would sell her pieces, but. She does crafting and stuff with hers, but she finds some amazing stuff. Um, and she has sent, she sent us a few, uh, we did a thing, but um, check out her too. She's got some good, but she told us that when you find an elephant and the trunk is up, that's a good luck. So we need some. It's all it. <gasps> Let me see that. That looks vintage too. That's painted on there. Maybe it's not vintage. That is, but that's like painted. That's paint. See, that's why it's chipping off. You might have to keep that one. Oh, cool. Put that one in your room. No? No. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, this one. Look at the tail moves. I don't know if it's supposed to. That's cool. I don't know if the tail's supposed to move, but it does. Will you show your personal collection someday? Me? Yeah. I don't have a personal collection. <laughs> I want to start one. So I've had some like ones that I like that aren't that great. And then um, some of my friends send some, like some of my friends will send me ones that they think I'll like. And so I want to start. Oh, that one's cute. Um, I want to start something. So I want to like, like you see some people where they use frames and then they do like a soft border or something and then you can poke them in there and have it so i i have room for that so i was thinking about doing something and then starting the starting a collection morgan might know what this is what the heck is that you know what that's from no <laughs> i have no idea what that's from what that's weird <laughs> that's funny it's got a mark on it Oh, you're yeah, gonna. How am I supposed to read that? <laughs> oh, shit. Maybe it's not a mark. I don't know. If it is a mark, I can't read it. Anybody know what this is from? <laughs> I have no clue. Maybe somebody will know. They look like oh, somebody said the posh cat. 
Hash from what? <laughs> Dwayne said it looks like Heather's tattoo on her leg. <laughs> looks like this? No, I think it was the um, oh. elephant, maybe. Oh. Okay, what is this, you guys? What are we going to call this? Yeah, I know. There's a there are some really cool ones in there, Don. That Jim's gonna like. All right. That was cool. I was happy. Oh wait, I want to put this in there. There's a couple of stones. You want me to put it in the bag? Yeah, hang on. I'm gonna put them in this bag and see if I can. A couple of the stones fell and they're in here. I don't see any more. I don't see any more either. Maybe I'll make a deal with Carla. I don't know. What kind of animal? I think we should call it Fred. <laughs> okay, that was Fred. If anybody knows what Fred is, who Fred is. So where are we from? We're from Minnesota. Yeah. Josiah is asking. We're from Minnesota. Okay. <laughs> Mark is going to talk for a minute. I got to get something to drink. <laughs> what do you want? Um, water. Anything else? No. Snack? Um, no. Snack? Chips. What kind? Um, Cheetos. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Ask about Josiah. What about you? Where are you from? <laughs> <laughs> like the chat, like blink. <laughs> no response. Cold over there. Florida. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Arizona. One's coming back. No, I think she is she or is she? Oh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> you find out anything about her? Um, she's from Arizona. How old is she? How old are you? <laughs> <laughs> we get personal on here. Yep. <laughs> We're always making you hungry. And vape, Daggy. Yeah, the summers. I heard the summers are horrible. Like you barely leave. So like for us, it's kind of the opposite. So like winters are horrible for us. Like we can leave, but like it's so cold. 20. 21. <laughs> She's 21. Oh my gosh. Are you on Instagram? Sorry, you guys. Everything's on hold. Gotta make Morgan a friend. <laughs> so, Morgan, you want to share a little bit about yourself? No. You want me to do it? You can do it. Why didn't you? <laughs> I can't think of anything about myself. Well, what, what's the, like, why did we start the channel? Oh, so because I got lonely. <laughs> so, why are you lonely? Because I have no friends. <laughs> because why? Because my friends are old friends are jerks. <laughs> so she's 21. She has autism. And so she's not able to go to college yet. 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 Is the key word. She will. And so that's why we started the YouTube channel was to give her something to do and like to meet people like you. Mm -hmm. Cool. So are you on Instagram? You are. Her link's down below. Add her. Cool. Yay. See, things cool. happen. Awesome. Thank you for coming to our channel. Jackie just wants to get... Uh, Jackie, we know you are here. <laughs> <laughs> we love you, Jackie.
No? Done. No. You're two minutes behind me? Like, you're going to come through the wall in two minutes? <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> she gets that all the time. <laughs> it's a part of the autism, I think. <laughs> and the Cambodian. Yep. <laughs> I'm 40. <laughs> Do I look 12? <laughs> Marco wants to go back to bed with her heated blanket. I can't stand this coldness. I know, it's so freaking cold. Oh, oh yeah. What is it today? Let me see. 13, 18. What's it feel like though? So it's 18, but then we always have windshield, so you 11. have to go based off of what it feels like. Where does it say that? No, that's. So it feels like zero. <laughs> so see, it says feels like zero. That's what it's like here. It's wonderful. Jackie's 29. She's old. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding she's gonna say sarah's older i think sarah's 31 oh, no freaking way i'm ready for this day <laughs> it's like today like a monday for a lot of people all right we're gonna start opening the other one i can sit here and talk to you guys forever i'll let her eat so this is the next one it's a big one i'm hoping this is Disney. A special one. No, I don't think this one's Disney. Oh, she's 27. You said 29. Oh, 29 months? You look tw like you're 29 months, Jackie. I look like I'm 29? Dang. <laughs> hey, Jackie. I'll pay you after the show. I'm 30 until Sunday. That's Sarah. That's right. She's going to be 31. A lot of people have birthdays this week. Mm -hmm. Birthdays or um, Stephen stuff have uh, anniversary. Did Carol go away? <laughs> yeah, she went. She had to go. Oh, she had to go and she never came. Oh, whatever. Angie looks like she's in her 30s. I want to look like Angie when I get older. Okay, this is... Andy, you're going to love this lot. You're going to love this lot. Margo. Okay. Let's guess Margo's age. Oh. <laughs> We're all scared. <laughs> you got like orange. She's got orange and now she's all embarrassed. <laughs> She's got Cheeto lips and teeth. <laughs> All right, we won't make her talk. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> it is what it is. For you. Oh, there's the babies. Valentine's babies. All right, so this was a Brighton jewelry with jewelry box and perfume. I spent a lot on this lot. But I know one, two things. I know I'll make my money. Two, I needed the jewelry box for myself so I can gift my mom with my old jewelry box, which she'll love. And she said you. I think she says to you. I love you too. You true girls. I can hang with that. Yeah. <laughs> We're true. You you get us. It's that's why we we named our channel Keeping It Real because that's what we believe. Like we want to be real. We want our viewers to feel like they can be real. Like, if you're looking for, like, real, like, like ones who have a script and all that kind of stuff, you're not going to find that on this channel. <laughs> if you can hang with us for a few hours when we go live, you'll love us. <laughs> all right? All right. So, the bid on this and, and the perfume. I know that the perfume in here... Is worth my it is expensive too. So I did spend a lot. So it's a hundred and two dollars and fifty cents is what I bought. What the the auction went for, 
And then with shipping, shipping, with shipping, 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 shipping is like shipping and handling together. <laughs> <laughs> Monica is, Dwayne said, Monica is not real. She's a figment of our combined imagination. <laughs> Dwayne, I don't think anybody would like want me in their imagination. No. <laughs> Don, don't until you absolutely must. This. Oh, go outside. Ugh. I know. Oh, we love you guys so much. That's why we love to come live because we, you know, like, when we just record, we don't get to be with you guys. It's not the same. We have to just be with each other. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? I don't know. <laughs> That's how you feel when you have to be with me? Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. So with shipping and handling, shipping is what we call that. <laughs> the grand total comes to a hundred and fourteen dollars and twenty-seven cents. Now, from my research, Brighton jewelry sells for very good money. So I don't have a lot of like personal jewelry and I have a little tiny um, jewelry box. Well, not tiny. It's a nice size jewelry box. Mine is. You have one that's kind of similar to it. Yeah. I think mine's a little bigger, isn't it? Yeah. Um, and it's a vintage one that I have, but I don't have a lot of stuff in it. So my mom needs one. I might give her that one for Christmas. So I hope she's not watching this video. Um, but if she is, she won't really care. <laughs> we kind of like pick... Oh, I want that. Okay, I'll buy it, and we'll just wrap it for you. That's kind of how our Christmas presents go. Yep. Um, so I just need something to keep a few things. So that was one reason I bought this, because pink is what my bedroom is. And I thought this was really a cool jewelry box. Jewelry box. First, they have, like, this on there. Um, it's made in China. It's nothing super-duper special. It has some, like... Scratches and stuff, but I might be able to clean clean it up pretty well. And then it just is a snap, kind of a magnetic snap, which is nice. It'll go really good in my room, I think. So I'm gonna switch them out, and then like it's really cute inside. Like it's got little pockets. It's got padding right there. This is really cute. That's oh, cute. All right. So then. Monica! Um, Monica! <laughs> Monica! Uh -huh, can you hear me? You're on a clock pedal! Hear me! <laughs> I feel like stuff is missing. But we'll see. Alright. So then that's what it looks like inside. And it's all like, feel that. It's like flush. It's like padded. Padded. So it's pretty clean in there. Can you close that? And then you can carry it like that, I guess. Wait. Oh, yeah. Let's just show them first. So this is how it came. I'm not seeing perfume. the perfume. I'm a little... Uh, oh, I think it's in here. All right. So it's this Brighton tin. <laughs> I guess that's your funny. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah. So then it's got like this writing. So you can see Morgan. <laughs> it doesn't come with Morgan though. And then it's got this Brighton. Whoa. Whoa. Break my computer. <laughs> Alrighty. So don't do that. Wild thing. This happened on this show. All right. So it's got like a leather brown, wouldn't you say? And then this is the necklace. So it's a pretty long one. But it's a Brighton necklace. All right. I'll have to figure that out. <laughs> <laughs> and then it has a tissue. A tissue. This is not a tissue. This is a cleaning cloth. But I don't know. Is that from Brighton? Ellie's Jewelry? 
I don't think that's from Brighton, is it, you guys? Quit throwing jewelry. <laughs> <laughs> I really want you to see it, Dwayne. Pink is my favorite color. Just say it. Say it, girl. You can hang with us. You want to open those? I think this is where the... And then there's this Brighton bag. I think the jewelry is in here. I hope it didn't break. There's a swatch. They did not wrap the jewelry very... Oh, my phone is going off and it's buzzing in my butt. Whoa! The swatch. Mm -hmm. It must have been on it. And then the swatch. I didn't see any of them because somebody was messaging me. So these are all Brighton. None, this one's not working. So I'll have to. How easy? I don't think any of them are working. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is like pop off. So they need to be cleaned up a little bit. What are they saying? Um, it's because you couldn't see with your glasses. Or cause you throw the bat. Well, see, you make my heart sing. You make everything groovy, baby. Well, thanks. Holly from a Brighton distributor. Okay. I have my contacts in. I have to go to the bank and start up an account for my friend GoFundMe so she can access the money money. Thanks for your help. Okay, we'll leave the link down below. Remember, um, Deb's friend had a fire and needed some help. Um, they lost everything, a house that they lived in for 30 years, probably 30 plus years. Um, so I'm going to put, it's not down there yet, but I'm going to put the link down below. So even if you can donate $5, please do that. Appreciate it. All right, so then this is a Burberry, which this is one of my favorites. It's just like a little one, but these things are so expensive. But it's just a little one, but this is my favorite, favorite, and I don't have any more, but I love, love, love me some Burberry perfume. So there was that perfume. Keep I'm keeping that one for myself, yes. Um, I don't know. This one says the, is that the Beat? The beat. Yeah, the beat. I never heard of that. So that's another little bottle. And then this one is another Burberry. It's called Body. Burberry is expensive, you guys. And then this is another Burberry. I love Burberry. But I might be keeping the perfume. You brought the camera to... You brought the bottle to the camera. Like, we could smell it. <laughs> smell, <laughs> smell it. it. Oh, I'm just showing it, Dwayne. Can you smell? <laughs> I can't smell. I can't smell this one. It's really light. Yeah, it's really light. Can you smell, Dwayne? What do you think? <laughs> so... I know I paid a lot extra for a little perfume for my sale. <laughs> All right. Then, let's go in there. There's still more. Whoa. So I listed 31 items yesterday, you guys. Watch. And it was a bunch of toys. Is that Brayton, too? Mm-hmm. I list a bunch of toys yesterday. I cleaned out one whole bin. I was so excited. And I've sold two items today. Oh my gosh. Like, what are the charms on it? Joy. 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 Yeah, Joy. <laughs> A drum and a bell. That's it? Yeah, and the other ones are just little gems. Other 
charm little bracelet. What's on that one? Secret love. I love that K drama. K drama. These are all Brighton, you guys. So Brighton, if you are out and about and want to know what you should be looking for, it out has like this heart with a B, with like a cursive B. That's what you look for. Is this thing? I think it's. I have no what idea. What the heck that. is this? I have no idea. It's like a Brighton bookmark. See, it's a, like a bookmark, but it, and this one is Brighton. Now, I sold a Brighton um, clock. Remember that clock, that little clock I got? That did not take very long to sell. We're missing stuff. Well, then we're going to hack it, hack all the parts. Can't wait till smell cam comes out. I don't want that to be fun. No, that will be bad, because if I'm stinky, then you can smell me. Smell cam never going to happen. Hack all the Oh, yeah. Now there's a small kid. In your video. Hello. Yeah, especially from like Stephen Stuff's page. There's this chain. And that was it inside those black pins. And then there's this necklace. Let's set the back of it. There's the front. And you can talk like you can feel it and tell it's nice quality, right? This one's cute. There's this necklace. Put the chesterels back. Oh, Carla, you gotta watch. There's lots of lots of cute cat pins we had gotten. These are all Brighton pieces, Carla. Let's set the back again, I think. Come on now. Cooperate. Can you see that? Very detailed, but the back even has detail, which is kind of cool. And the last piece. I have no idea. Like you could kind of wear it either way, right? Mm -hmm. Is this necklace. So, I'm kind of excited to play with this brand. I knew this thing sterling. How would I? Are they asking me that? Yeah. I don't know. How would I know? Put it. So this is where I struggle. Like it's not. Well, that would be silver. So how do you know if it's sterling, Carla? Wow, thirty-two <laughs> minutes on it. I know. Like I bow to you, Angie. I think they will only do like five. On the torture mission, the cardio—that's that. The maybe you, like ten seconds. <laughs> sterling will say it. You haven't had, oh, with the purses. It's not 925. That's silver. And these aren't silver pieces. I don't see. Marking or anything. What's that? I mean, I see the Brighton mark. It's not silver. Yeah, I don't think Brighton does that type of stuff. I don't know if Brighton is. I mean, I'll have to look through. I'm just trying to look quick. One of the necklaces you sent was sterling. I bet you didn't notice. I didn't until last night. May I sent you some silver? Dang. Yeah, I don't think Brighton is. But there it's an like they have a following, so people will pay good money. It is a higher quality, but I don't think it is. I mean I'll have to look. But yeah, Carla, send me a picture of where I'm missing silver and just like sending it to my friends. 
Now we're best friends, right, Carla? <laughs> What do we do? Dwayne, I don't want to be a wrench anymore. It's too trendy. <laughs> Dwayne, how many times do I have to tell you? Um, no, let's put this in the bag. Okay. Let me put that in there, and then we have where's the big bag? Because I want to take the perfume upstairs. Okay. And then, here, put that, just put the bright and stuff in it, yeah, and then that, and then the thing. Okay, I'm learning. I sent you silver. Well, now I can't say I didn't, I sent you crap, <laughs> because I sent you silver. Well, I was wondering, I'm like, wow, watch, I send her gold. <laughs> <laughs> At least I didn't send you gold. That probably would have made me feel even worse. Yep. It's yeah. the stepper machine. Mm -hmm. I mean, I think I'll be able to make a good chunk of my, you know, make some profit. I mean, especially since I'm keeping most of the perfume. Have you ever heard of a Brighton piece being um, sterling or silver, Angie? You lied about what? I lied it? I'm confused. Carla, you're confusing me. The snow is getting to your head. I can confidently say that. Liked it. Oh, not lied it. <laughs> was like, lie. You lied about liking it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't lie. I don't lie. My hips don't lie. <laughs> I like your big. No lie, no lie. <laughs> no lie, no lie. Arriba, arriba. Reminds me of that little uh, Mexican uh, mouse. <laughs> but I don't know. I need. I guess I'll have to research that if any Brighton stuff is ever sterling silver or silver altogether. I'm excited to see the piece. We got no more to show. And you guys can't smell. I like I want to smell this one though. What's you guys' favorite perfume? I don't have a favorite perfume. Don't wear it. I do wish these had like the little um squirters. Oh, that smells good. You wanna smell it? No. You don't want to smell sure. it? Sure. You just said no. <laughs> You like the smell of that? Okay. No, that's a no. Like, I want more fruity smell. You like more fruity. It looks like brand new though. Like it's not very full. I mean, this one isn't my favorite either. Can you sell these kinds of things on eBay? I never have. What's this one smell like? You want to see the cat roaches? Should we show them to her? Sure. You want me to do it? Yeah. Okay. Are you tired? Are you going to leave? No. Just... You're just going to relax? Yep. Wait, I just want to smell this. I have not seen any. Jennifer, where the heck you come from? Hi, Jennifer. Have you just been hiding out? Most bright is not silver, but they did have a line called Brighton Treasures that was 925. So check pieces with care in case you happen on one of those treasured lines. Okay, I will do that. I'm leaving, Jim. We'll catch you later. Love you, Angie. Say bye to Angie. Bye, Angie. Like Victorian Secrets Love Spell. Ooh, I like some of Victoria. They're expensive, too. 
Thank you, Jennifer, for coming in and sharing that. What do you think of that one? I like that one. I like that one, too. Okay, who of my reseller friends know can we sell perfume? I'm not going to sell this one. I like that one. But I might have a couple I want to sell. Can I do that on eBay? All right. We're going to go back into the brooches. So if you're coming to join us at this point or you have watched up to this point and we are no longer live, I will tell you right now, you can now leave because we're going to re-show things that we have already shown. So we're going to do a quick goodbye to those that are leaving us now. Goodbye. Bye. Remember to keep keeping it real. And we see, you see you next, next time. time. And to make sure you subscribe. Now, if you are one of our true people that will hang in there with us till the end, keep on sticking around because you never know what's going to come out of my mouth. But we're going to show the pins again for Carla. <laughs> I have to ship grown. Okay. It's a private show. No, no, no. We, oh, yeah. Private show for Carla. You want me to show you everything? I'm not trying to, like, diss Morgan there. <laughs> okay, Carla. Am I showing you everything? Or just the cats? Do best of show. Best of? Oh, jeez. Bye, Josiah. Bye. Add Morgan on Instagram if you have Instagram. And we hope to see you again. It was so great meeting you. Thank you for coming. Well, I don't know what's best of because I thought everything was pretty cool. So I'm just showing. I'll show it fastly. And if you want to see it more, can I hand them to you and at least... Yeah. Have you do that or what? How about that? I'm going to show them and then Carla, if you want to see it. Oh, no, I'll put it here and then. There's that. Hey, Purple Lily. Car Carla, I found a Monet piece. Is this it? Yeah. See, I found a Monet piece that found me. Carla, this is a JJ piece that's broken. Can you fix it? So there's a cat piece. Let's see, it's broke. You love what? Okay, because we're going through it so fast, you're going to have to be specific what you love. Because remember, there's a delay. So we might be five pieces in and you say you love it. If you want to go, you can go. Okay. I'm going to go, guys. Bye. She's bored. She's over it. How are you going to go? You're going to have to crawl under. Don't knock the perfume. Hey, if I give you... Can you do that? That's not going to work. Happening. I don't know what's happening. Trying to get out. What do you want me to? Can you? Well, you got to carry that your stuff. Yeah. So maybe can you just can you take those? Do you think? I'll just put them on my dresser. Mm -hmm. All right. We're switching. Okay, you love the butterfly. Marvin's leaving. <sighs> I'm moving over. I'm going to re refigure myself here. Oh. Yeah, I like this butterfly too. Hey, this will work because what I'll do is I'm going to, because there's some pieces that are like need fixing like this. 
Bob! So I don't know if that can get fixed. Or if it's just like done for. I'm going to put my lot of items that are like missing stuff or broken in a different bag. And this is a bummer, but this is missing. Carla, if I send you pins like this that like are missing the rhinestone, like are these type of rhinestones up here? See, like it's, like is that missing it or is it just darkened? It feels like it's kind of there. Can you see that? What do you think? Can I fix that? Yeah, I don't think that's going to be for crafting. What do you think about this guy, the eagle? Tell me what I should do with the eagle. Do I sell it this way? Do I use it for crafting? Do I fix it? I don't know. I put them aside. Yeah, they can be expensive. Then there's this little lizard guy. He's really cute. So let me know. Say eagle. What I should do with it. My hair is everywhere. And this is a laurel bark, birch. I'll show you the back of it. So this is what he looks like. And then this is what. You guys see that? I guess you can't see it very good. I did do it, but it feels like it's there, but it's kind of like it feels like. Oh, there. Yeah, I think it's part of it's gone or something. I may have to go in a crafter's lot. Okay, how much did I pay for this lot? Um, I moved it. I couldn't find it. So this was from Shop Goodwill. Um, and so I won the bid for nine. It's a two pound lot of brooches. I won the bid at nine ninety nine, and then with shipping and handling. It came to $24.61. Get craft. Okay. I want to just show you guys the back. I don't know if you guys can see it. Let's see if I... Oh, you can see my eye. I'm trying to figure out. You guys see that? Maybe not. Yeah, that's it. I got that little guy, but he has some markings on him. And then. Ooh, okay. How many problems? Mother of Pearl, correct? Little butterfly. Kind of got some dirt or something right there. And then that's what the back looks like, which would be mid century with that backing, correct? This is like a more detailed showing than what I showed before. <laughs> uh, well, there's that guy. All his stones are there. He's really cute. Uh, that's what his back looks like. He's got some weight. Yeah, I know. Cool. And then there's this guy. Little hummingbird. Got a couple hummingbirds. And he doesn't seem to be missing any stones. There was a couple really cool birds that were missing some stones. Okay. 
Okay, this guy's marked. I don't think, I think it's a Monet. Mm. Roman? Was Roman on the back of this one? This little Scotty dog. I love him. He's so cute. Just love him. Love him, love him, love him. And this one is broken. So this will have to go in a craft lot. This is one of those butterflies. But it's right here. I think. Where is he broke? Yeah. See, this part right here is broke. So he'll go in a craft lot. But these guys are cute. These are good for crafting, though. What's that word mean? Mar Carol said Marsettis for the Scotty. Is that the type of stone? So cute. Okay, here's a, a craft, or a craft, a cat one. Okay, so Carla, let me know the cat ones you want me to put aside that you think your hubby will love. All right, and then I'll put them aside for him. Um, but here's the first one. That's not broken. This one's really cool. It's got kind of, it's kind of weighty too. And then I don't know, can you see that mark? That's the marking on it. But see how, I mean, it's it's weighty. Oh, that's the name of the stone. I won't remember, so I'll probably have to ask you again. <laughs> and we can't say, damn it, I can't say. I need a pen. Morgan! I'm stuck where I am. I need to start bringing a pen with me. Well... Well, that's Liz Claiborne. It's cool, though. I mean, they put some time into that. But like I said, let me know. Yeah, it's two-tone. If you want me. I won't remember, Kyla. Look, I'm going to put the cats over here, and you're going to let me know which ones I should put aside for him. Except I think there's one of them you can't have. Me and Morgan love it so much. Now this one is a craft one. That's like missing a stone. Like right there. Which is too bad because it's really cool. That's going in. To the craft pot. This is an Avon. Okay. I got to decide. This is an Avon frog. Avon, so I found in this lot, Avon and um, Monet. Now watch, there'll be a Sarah. Come, now that I'm going through it again, I'll find a Sarah. Sarah. <laughs> like you said, Carla, they always find me. This is a cute, I'm, always, I'm checking to make sure all the stones are there. Now if you guys see a piece and I don't notice the stones missing, let me know. This is a little bunny. Hi, Peace. Who doesn't have a wrench? Oh, I fix that. Sorry. To fix that. This is the one you can't have. Because I love this one too much. Like its head. <laughs> it's really going. But look at that one. Like, I don't know if I'm ready to let this one go. I can't tell if there's a mark on it. The back's really weird. Like, look at this back, Carla. I don't know if you can see. Can you see that? Have a great day, Don. Love y'all.
interesting. Then there's this giraffe with the rhinestone. That one's cool. He's weighty too. Yeah, and then once I'm bored, then I'll send it to him. <laughs> and there's this elephant. He's heavy. Some of them are pretty heavy. Some of them aren't marked though. I should have my magnet here and I can be checking them that way too. This one looks okay. Little dragonfly. Oh no, he's not okay. He's missing a he's missing a leg. Okay. And then the craft lab. Yep, welcome. A purple lily, welcome to the family. Yep, lucky elephant. Yep, because the nose is up. I know that. This is a cool cat one. Oops. Look at that one. You can feel the difference in texture. That one's really cool. That's what the back looks like. Oh, poor bait. I know there's some cute ones. <clears throat> there's some cute ones that are. Oh, this has a mark. This has A L P. Alpa. Mexico. This one says. That one's cool. You got a call in, you got the dragon flu. You think he'll like this one? And then, am I going too slow? I feel like I'm going too slow. I know I'm going to get comments on this, like, why do you show it again? And then there's this little mousy. And then look, its tail wiggles. Isn't that cute? And that's what that looks like. And then what would this be? It's a magical illness, right? Okay, I got that one aside. This one, and if there's any other ones you see that you guys want, let me know. Um, or set aside. But this one is so cool, right? And then look, like even like the fake pearls on the side. I'm surprised this one is not marked, but it's I don't see any markings on this guy. Wait, this screws off. I don't get what this is for, but one side of this does unscrew. Like this part, it unscrews. But this is what the backing is. What would that be? Like for a scarf? What would that be? So interesting, but there's a lot of detail in him. He's so cool. I know that mouse is cool. Do you want me to set the mouse aside? Because he just loves them. I don't know. It's so interesting, but you can unscrew it. And I'm surprised with the detail that there's no markings anywhere on him. So cool. So, so cool. Okay. And there's this cat pin. And it has, can you see that? I think it's like S. Spoon teaks or something like that is what it looks like. Yeah. Let me know what you think of that one, Carla. No, that I don't know what that cobra one. It's so cool, but I don't know what it is. This one's broken. 
It was a swordfish, but right there his thing is broken. That goes in the craft lot. So if you guys know anybody who likes animal pins for craft lots, send them my way. And this one's really cute. It's a little crab. And that looks like a, you know, a real seashell. And there's a few little rhinestones in there. He's really cute. And Angie said that, Carla, this is something I asked Angie. Me and you were talking about this. But on these pins, where they have this square here, that does mean that they are older. They're not more modern when they have that square there. Because a lot of the newer ones don't have that now. So, he's pretty cool. You know, the poor swordfish. Okay, you gotta let me know about this one. And did you want me to put this one aside? Really? Cool. Peace, you have some good sales. And this one, too, um, is going in the craft lot right up here. The rhinestone is missing. And then right in there. Which is a bummer because it's so cute. I love it. Really? Crab is so cute. And then here's another um, older one, which is this little puppy. He's got little red rhinestone eyes. Yeah, I know. That's what I thought. Because I we were talking about that. And so um, when I was showing these and Angie was here, I was like, what is this? Because I don't find it on a lot of them. But I don't, she didn't know, like, like the ones that was mid-century, so I don't know what the age on these would be, but she would say it would be more of a vintage piece, so that's good. Okay, so I got, I'll show you the ones at the end that I got for you. Really? You think so? I was maybe thinking of, this one's really weird, you guys. Um, just selling all these together that are, have like some stones and stuff missing. Like just selling like a crafter lot of them. Um, and I'd go through like my other, I have a crafter's lot. Um, and looking for all the like um, animal pins that I have. And then just trying to sell it as a lot maybe is what I do. Well, this one is interesting. See this bug? I mean, it's really, really detailed, right? And then it's got these really long legs that have this. So, like, this is how you would wear it. Like that. Is that not the weirdest looking thing ever? And then that's what the back looks like. That's so weird. Somebody will love that. And you can kind of move the legs a little bit. Oh, you took some time into that. Oh, thank you. It was fun, wasn't it? I thought it was I thought it was kind of a cool idea that Dwayne had was having a few people. I mean, I don't know. Did you guys feel like there was too many people? I know that bug is so weird. It's such a, but it's really pretty though too, so it's really weird. Oh, maybe a hat pin. I think that bug you could do some fun stuff with it. Uh. And then this one I think is, is not, this one's missing a rhinestone in one of his eyes right there. And I might have that rhinestone. I might have the green one. I'll have to see if I can fix it. Or I'll just say forget it and just sell it in a lot of other ones. But he is cute though. I was surprised not a lot of them had Mickey. It was fun. But do you think, like, because there was, do you think there was too many of us? Or do you think it was the right number? Like, you know, Dwayne was afraid, like, it went too long. I, d I don't know. What do you guys think? This was really cool. I like this guy. He's enamel. He's got some really pretty colors. Oh, the draft is cool. I wished it wasn't missing anything. 
Now this one isn't as high quality, but he is cute for a little lion. But see how he's kind of hollowed out? And then he kind of goes lips up like that, and he's not very weighty. Oh, I love that giraffe. Love this. I keep reading, rereading it. That bird's pretty. Okay. And you guys didn't think I went too long? Just so I can let Dwayne know. Because I think he left. Okay. I think all the rhinestones. I see all the rhinestones are there. This guy's cute. This little dragonfly. I love the green. My phone coin. Yeah, I know. I was just thinking that when I said it. <laughs> like, that's me and Carlos turn weighty. Weighty. And I swear, in this one, I'm, I know you guys can't see it, but this one's really cute, right? But I swear, inside here, I can't see it, but I swear it's right here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it says EAT, E-A-T. And I don't know why somebody would put that in there if that would be a marking. But it says EAT. It says E-A-T. And they can't, I don't know if it's showing up. Can you guys see? Like, what is that? That Mike wins all the, but this time Mike didn't win all the jewelry because my two pieces didn't go to Mike. One went to Angie and one went to, um, Silver Hair, Todd, Silver Hair, um, Stacker, I think it is. Carol's back, back from shopping, driving home, watching, scored tots for 447. Wow. That's great, Carol. Morgan was wondering if you went into H Mart. I feel like I missed something. I was just staring. Like somebody's going to watch that. I was like, what is she doing? No H mark. I don't know why that would say that. I uh, went into a trance there for a minute. Okay, this is my favorite, favorite. This one I'm keeping. And it's pink. I don't even know if it does justice, but look at the detail. I'm keeping this one. No, she doesn't need anything. She's good. Okay, and then I'm checking to see if any of them. Okay, here's a Carla. Look at this one, Carla. Let me know. Morning. We've been on for a while. We're still on. Reshowing. Reshowing stuff. I don't see a marking on that, but that's a little gold tone frog. That's the back of him. This one has a marking on it, but I don't think I can. I think I tried before and I couldn't make it. Like some of them, they're so hard to make out. Oh, well, I guess it's not. It doesn't even look like a marking now that I look at it. So I'll show you this little guy. See, this is what I was looking at. Like I thought that was a marking, but it's not. It's like nothing's there. Get it. Okay. So that one. This one. Okay. 
in the northwest here just got back from feeding the chickens where are you exactly where's your northwest i'm in minnesota i'm super north <laughs> The northwest i don't know where that'd be i'm horrible with directions and then there's this little did you guys say he's ceramic right he's like that's what the back looks like so i think you know it's ceramic right when it has that hole in there but he's a cute little froggy which morgan hates frogs Oregon. Oh, I love Oregon. When I was younger, I think I was like 16. Um, I lived out in Seattle for, no, 16, maybe I was 17. Let's say I have 17. Uh, me and Morgan's dad moved out to Seattle, Washington for a while. And we used to go to Oregon in the mountains and stay up in the mountains and pick bear grass um, and sell it to the florals. That's how we made money. It was beautiful up there. Look at that frog. <laughs> yeah, right. I know. I'm almost there with you, Carla. A little tree frog guy with um, some little stones in his eyes. This piece is really cool. I don't remember seeing this. Morgan must have shown this one. This is a Monet. Monet must have had a, like a period that they did butterflies. But look at it, it's like doubled. That one's really cool. I didn't even see that one. I know it's so pretty there. I loved it there. And this piece, it's a little poodle. Might send this one to Dawn. She likes poodles. He's so cute. I think he's missing a couple um, things up there, but Dawn won't care. I'm going to put that one aside. And this guy's missing a little, um, he's missing two little per fake pearls. But he's so cool. He's got all his little rhinestones right there. But we'll go in the crafter lot. No, this one I'm gonna this one I think I'm gonna send to I'm gonna send this one to a friend. That one I will. But I have this lot now that is all gonna be like the crafter lot that I'll put out. And I'm going through this. So this helps me. It's saving me another process that I would have to do. This thing is really weighty. Um, but really cool. This is a lion. Look, he moves. It reminds me of like those door knocker kind of. But he's heavy. He's really cool. There's him. To Don? Send you, send what? I'm going to send this to Don. I know. So that's kind of like a cat. I don't know if he'd like that. But it does. It reminds me of like one of those door knockers. And then he, yeah, it's so cool. Let me know. I'll put it on my side. I don't know if I can fix them though. How do I find the pearls? I don't know if I can find pearls. Maybe. Yeah, I'll put them out. Maybe I'll try to fix them. And then there's this guy. He's really colorful. He's cool. And then this fly is so cool. 
take. So, like, can you see that? No, oh, and Andy was like surprised because I did not see. I'm gonna look again, but I don't see any. Oh, there is. There's a marking. It's like way deep in there. This is craft. C R A F T. Is that a brand? That's all it says on there is craft. T R. Oh, you guys want to spell craft? Yeah, I have a Hobby Lobby. It's a craft. That's all it says on it is craft. That's the only mark I could find on them. Ooh. And it's like way down in there. I don't know if you guys can see that, but maybe if I move this. You see that? So cool. I'm obsessed with animal things, animal pins. <laughs> Right, All right. A crow craft and hill craft. But does their marking just say craft? Like it doesn't. Oh, and digging back in the bag, like there was no other. It was just craft. That's all it said. That one I might have to take a picture of. That's some cool ones, you guys. This was a good lot. But I'm surprised how many of these pins are so amazing. But how many of them don't have like any type of markings. Like this is so cool. This owl. But it is missing. It's missing one little rhinestone right there. But I still might try to saw him separate because he's so cool, even with that one missing rhinestone. I don't know. What do you guys think? And then this uh, this B has its A F J is what it says. But that's a little B. He's really cute too. You don't think so? What? That was adorable. You got a good deal. What don't you think so? On the craft thing. And then there's this little dove with the holly leaves. Oh, I think I'm going to sell that owl even though it's missing that. I think that one I am going to sell. Even though, did you see if any stones were in the bottom of the bag? Yeah. Um, not many were in there. There might be a, enough to, f nope, there wasn't even enough to fix. There wasn't much. And this is another lion pin. An interesting lion. So this lot was, so the bid was $9.99. Um, but with shipping and everything, the to grand total was $24.61. Here it is again, you guys. So this is twice. So I'm going to show it to you. This is what it, because this is exactly what it looks like in that one piece. And you can see it better on here where it says the craft. I hope you guys can see this. See how it says craft? See that? That's what's in that on that other one, that B one. It's the exact same thing. So it's the same maker. 
This one's really cool. It doesn't say the craft, it just said craft. So it says C-R-A-F-T. So that's two pieces like that that I have that the pieces are gorgeous. And then this one just has a number on it. It's got 8730 or 67. I think it's 8730. This is interesting. I'll show you the marking, but it's this koala. But back here, right there, it has just a number. Oh, <laughs> the craft, yeah. The craft. I don't think this one does. I'm going to look. I'm gonna have to be really careful when I look at it and make sure I don't miss any marks. That one's really cute, too. This one's really cool, too. I love this one. I don't see any marks on this guy either, but this one's really cool. You see this little fly and then his wings like flutter and then there's that big rhinestone there Isn't that cool you see that but I don't see any marks on him Sorry. Gem Craft Corporation. That's what it's seeing on illusions. Oh. We got some cute here. Alright, then there is this polar bear sitting on a fake pearl, which I think he is so cute. So cute. And then there is this. I think he's good. This lizard. That's pretty cool. And then there's this hummingbird. And then there's this little, with the spun butterfly. I don't know if this one was, I don't think this one was marked or not, but that one's really cute. It's really simple and basic and really lightweight. Yeah, great. And fish. So this is a wooden hand painted, really big fish. And it's pretty big. So if somebody likes fish, that'd be good for them. Sorry, I had to take the week. <clears throat> okay. There's a couple I'm saving to the end because I want Carla's one. There's some more, you guys. Vlog was crazy. Look at this owl. Isn't that cool? I love the color of it. Uh, that's what the back looks like. There's no marking on that one. And then there's this cat pin. I thought Morgan would want this one, but she doesn't. And he's got a little rhinestone eyes, and then he's got a little rhinestone right there. So, Carla, it's up for the taking. I'll put it aside. Let me know. And then, look at this guy. Isn't he cool? Like, with that rhinestone right there. I wanted to really look at and make sure there's no markings on him, but I don't see any markings on him, but he is so cool. Hi, Aaron. Oh, yeah. Modern 
modernistic. Carla, I need you to like help me with my wording. But I think he's cool. Carly, you gotta let me know. Do you want the me to put the black cat aside? So I know which one's hey. Ashley, hello. Hey, here at work trying to tune in before the boss comes back. Yeah, don't get in trouble. I don't want you guys to get in trouble. All right, then we got these really cool drafts. You see them? They're really cool. I like them. But their back keeps opening. <laughs> Pinging me. Let's see. And I think this one is a donkey. And I think it's a vintage because it's got that square on the back. The little donkey guy. Donkey guy. See, he's got that square on the back, so he's more of a vin he's vintage. And then here's another. I got a lot of cute hummingbirds. Okay, got the black kitty aside. I mean, would you guys suggest like for like the fish ones, selling them separate or selling like a fish lot? um yeah the donkey looks vintage the same with like i got a bunch of these hummingbirds should i sell them separate or sell them as a lot like what would you guys suggest but this one is like it's kind of stained glass is what like i don't know if you guys can see that on there but see so you can kind of see through you see that which is really kind of cool i think personal thing that i thought that was kind of cool all right, this is a really simple dragonfly with just like the rhin big rhinestone for the head. He's really simple, but really cute. I can't tell if that's a marking or just the. Oh, no, no. All right, then. I'm checking the stones too, that's why. Here's this guy, he's really cute. He's got a lot of stones and a lot of enamel. He's in perfect condition, he's really cool. That dragonfly? I didn't see. It is really lightweight though. I don't have my magnet right next to me. I'll test it though with the magnet and see. I'll test all the ones and keep them make sure. In case I should be looking a little well. I obviously don't do very well since I sent Carla some silver. The snail. There's this little snail guy. And then yeah, message me later, peace. You got my email right. Are we friends on Facebook? That's what he looks like. He's cute. He's kind of weighty. I don't remember seeing this guy either. Japan. Yeah, so it's Japan, but oh. Puppy, he's cute. I like him. I think when Morgan was, and oh, I got some good ones. I thought I was pretty happy with this lot. Oh, One bad thing about pins, you get poked. When you get poked, a few more. We're, almost, we're getting to the end people again. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so Carla, let me know if you guys will want this. It is broken though, so 
but um, he's really cute. It's Avon though, but um, otherwise I'll put him in the craft lab. But see, this part right here is broken, but he's really cute. But if you don't want him, I'll put him in the craft lab. So let me know. One sec. All right, and then there was this metal, he's metal, McCoy. You okay? Did you want back in? Let me finish this. Morgan's coming back. We're almost at the end and they're coming back. <laughs> Yeah, you can send it to my Gmail. Oh, you have that one. Okay, I'll put it in the craft lab then. So then this is kind of that same donkey. So we had two of these. But this one is missing the gem inside. I mean, they did sell them as a lot. And then, oh, we had two of these, too. Mm -hmm. There was two of these flies. So I don't think I would sell them as a lot. I don't know. This one's cool. This one, was this one missing any gems? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's this guy. He's really cute. You're back. Yeah, I have one. I have this one, which isn't my all-time favorite, and I have another one. But I'm learning how to... Yeah, this one. Because then I just get, like, a little red one, right? And just put them back in there. I think I could do that. And then this guy was really cool, too. This has a marking. So this one, this is like, I think it's Kenneth Cole, is it? Kenneth Lane? Not Kenneth Cole, it says Kenneth Lane. L-A-N-E, but he's really cute. This one says Kenneth Lane. I like him. I think the, this one from the other one, because I had the other one, I think it was red. Wasn't it? Mm -hmm. okay. If we're talking about the... Yeah. One looks smaller, doesn't it? Kind of. No, but they have different tails. See, his is red. I could do red or green. That one's worth money. Well, I'm putting it aside. I'm going to sell it. <laughs> Put it aside for who? You want to buy it? <laughs> that one is cool. There's some cool ones in here. We got lucky. I think, don't you? Mm -hmm. All right. So, Carla, are you paying attention? Kenneth J. Lane Designer. Cool. Oh, yeah, they could. So I got to fix, all I can fix is I. So we have a three legged dog. Is it just the pillows moving? I felt like 
that scared me and my phone fell. <laughs> and I thought it was like the cat. I could feel like something moving and I looked and nothing was there. Yeah, I know. I was kidding. See how detailed he is? But he's missing a leg here. So I was thinking, and then he's really cool, right? Because he's one where he you can make him into a necklace too. So Carla, what I was thinking is, is I could market him as a three-legged dog. Carla's like, what a weird-looking dog. I think I could try to sell them separately as a three-legged dog because some people have three-legged dogs. What do you think? And that's a mess. One to I want to see what they think. Yes, I think so too. Everybody else thought it was crazy. I think it's a great idea. I know, I think the dog is cool. He has actually for he has some really good detail, doesn't he, Maury? Mm-hmm. He's actually really cute. Handy, capable. <laughs> I bet somebody will buy it. Because they have a one -le three-legged dog. So many people I know, like, something happened to their dog and they become a three-legged dog. I think, yeah, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it and keep you guys updated. <laughs> okay. Then we have, what, Fred. This is We're calling Fred. this guy Fred. Because uh, we don't know who it is. Let me come closer. We don't know what it's from, who it is, what the heck. <laughs> is it a cat? What is this thing? Too bad he didn't have that little cat to get around. <laughs> what do you think? So weird. It's so weird. And like the marking on the back is so, I can't even, I don't even think it's a mark. It, it looks like yeah. it's so small. Like it's scary. I'm just trying so hard. I cannot make it out if there's anything. Turn what upside down? The pen, maybe? I'm blind right now. Turn this upside down? Like, I think there's a little mark right in there. And I have tried so hard to see it, but I can't. I no idea. We're hoping that somebody will watch us and let, help us name who is Fred. I'll probably put him in, maybe put a, take a picture and put him in the jewelry Facebook group and see you. So that's what we got. So I think it's a piece. This is what would be in the crafter jewelry. I don't know if I have any more. Of the animal pins. I'd have to look. But message me if you're interested. And then Carla. We got this one. This one. Whoops. Let me know if there's any of these you want pulled out of your lot. That one. That one. I, didn't, I think you said you wanted this one. And then, which I love this one. That one's so cool. Right? That one a mess. 
Mm-hmm. You look tired. You look so tired. I promise you when you get fed and then maybe you can go out to eat. Yes to everything but the little pin. To you don't want this one? This little pin? Or this little pin. Okay, well, I just want to make sure I have what you want. I should have you go get me some little babies. Okay. Okay, oh. Can you get wait wait, I was gonna move this. You know where they are, right? So this little pin, okay. Yeah, and the top one. I need three. He said, no, I love the most. Keep the You want to keep the most, right? Keep the most in your... Yeah. <laughs> Do you want the most or you want me to keep the most? Oh, I'm so confused, Carla. You're confusing me. Yeah, so if there's anything that you're interested in um, that you saw in this lot, like you can message me. Is that all you wanted? Was to ask me that? Yeah. Okay. Mess um, I sent you a message. Can you answer me? Okay. Carla is that. Um, you can message me on Facebook if we're Facebook friends. Or if we're not Facebook friends, add me on Facebook. Um, or you can message me at my at my Gmail account, which that link, that email is down below. Um, and we can avoid the whole, uh, eBay and all of that. Um, and, and we can do it through ourselves, through PayPal. You do have to have a PayPal account. Um, tell them not to watch the show. So, yeah, that's all we have. Did you get, and I think everybody else saw everything. I mean, if you got to rewatch it, but it was fun to go through it again because, so that's what I do, like for all of my lots, just to tell you when I get them, um, you know, I kind of show you guys and then I kind of put them aside. And then when I'm about to go through them to clean them, even like the Disney jewelry that I get, I go through it and I kind of look through it like, this is okay and this is not this is something i'd like to sell this is not and kind of go through it and kind of sort it out that way and then i clean the stuff or, and so that's kind of what i do and then i have ones that are already clean and so i put those in a certain bin so i know that they're ready to list um and then the ones that aren't clean i have those in a separate area and then that's how and then the ones that are listed i have those in a separate area yep so this was from um shopgoodwill.com and if you guys haven't checked them out, like, watch some of my other videos, too. If you guys have any questions about things, like, feel free to message me. I'll try to help you. Um, you're so welcome. Uh, and so I'll message, you You know. So what I do on Chop Goodwill is whatever I'm looking for. And they sell everything, you guys. Like, anything you can think of, you can find on this place. And a lot of people don't like it. They don't support it. Um, for me, it's been a good sourcing place for me. I've gotten some good deals and some bad deals. Like it happens just like when we thrift. Um, but you can sometimes, and this is a lot, like I sometimes go on there and just look for, like use different types key searches and stuff. Um, and this is one of those that uh, nobody bid on this one at all. So, um, but make sure. Hi, we're just getting over, but thank you for being a new subscriber and coming on. Yeah, I've gotten some good ones. 
I mean, you do pay on some other ones, but I haven't, to be honest, there's only like, I think one item that I ever, or maybe a couple items and they were precious moments items. And it was a couple of reasons why, not just because of Shop Goodwill, but I do see some that go outrageous, but I am very careful. So number one thing on Shop Goodwill is make sure that when you can check what the shipping and handling cost is going to be to you before you even bid. So make sure that if you're going to buy on there, that's the first thing that you do before you even bid on that item so that you know exactly what that fee is going to be. So you know to make sure you're adding that onto whatever you bid. And so that that is what help, has helped me. And that is the only way. Hello, Bev's Lamb. Um, that was how I lost money at the beginning was that I didn't realize that it was that expensive because their fees for shipping and handling you guys are outrageous. They do not use some of the great tools that are out there to lower the shipping. And I don't know why, but they don't. And it makes me sad because they could be saving us a lot of money, but it is what it is. So just to let you know that I will tell you two more things. One, I have received a broken, like I had bought an, um, an item from there and it was broken. I contacted them and they ref the, refunded all of my money. Now I've had every place is different who you're bidding from. So there's different, it's just like different sh stores that are a part of the shop goodwill. Yeah, the shipping handling is crazy. So you need to always keep that in mind. Um, there's a few of them that are better than other ones. So that's why I said, always make sure you check that piece of it because some of them are not bad. Um, but like this lot could have been put in a fl uh, padded flat rate and it would have been a lot cheaper than what I paid. So I wish they would figure out how to ship these, but they don't and I don't know why. Um, I have had one company or one store that has been a problem for me. Um, they shipped me the wrong item and they did, I did get my right item, but the item that they shipped me that was wrong. Yeah. With the Harry Potter box. Right. So what ha that's what happened. I got this and it was a great box, but here's the problem. Contacted them said, you sent me the wrong item. Oh, we're so sorry. Shipped out the right one. Never. And then closed the case. So every time you, you need to talk to one of these stores, you have to open up a case. They closed it. They didn't say, we're so sorry. Here's a refund of any of your money. They didn't say anything about what to do with the other box. So I had to reopen the case and say, hey, are you going to do anything for me for this mistake? And what am I supposed to do with this other item? I'm looking over here because the box is still here. Um, and they said, oh, we will refund you for shipping and handling. And we're send we'll email you a shipping label so you can mail the box to the person who won it. So they were going to send me a shipping label with this customer's home address, like with their address and name, which I thought was totally like should not be okay. Like you should not give a stranger and other person's information, but I never got the email. And so I messaged them um, the next day and said, there's been no email. I didn't get anything. How do you, what am I supposed to do? So then they said, well, you know, that they're going to send it a different way. So they said that they sent the label in a different way and I never got it. It never came. And it's so weird because I get emails from them all the time. Like, you know, you won, you lost, somebody outbid you, you need to pay, you haven't paid, you know, you have one more day to pay or you're going to be in trouble. Like I get all these other emails, but I didn't get this one they're saying. And I get tons of emails all the time, right? So I messaged them and said, so then they said, well, we don't know. It's obviously on your end. I'm like, I have checked my junk mail. I have checked everything. I don't get it. I get tons of emails. And they're like, well, it's on your end, not on our end. And so now um, the only thing we can think of is that you're going to have to mail it back to us and pay for the shipping. And we'll try to figure out if there's a way that we can refund you. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm not paying to ship it back to them. And especially when 
all that they refunded me was the shipping and handling on my item. And now they want me to ship it back to them. So what I think, which was interesting because before they wanted it shipped to the customer. So what I think happened was the customer who won this lot asked for their money back. They didn't want it anymore. They were done with it. So then now they want it back. And so they want me to pay for it and they're not going to refund me my money because I was thinking, well, we already refunded her for the shipping on it for the first place. So um, it will be squashed. That's what I think happened. Mother's mustache. First time you've been in here. So this is with Shop Goodwill. So I buy from Shop Goodwill a lot. Like it's one of my one of my number one sourcing places. I buy all my Disney jewelry through them and other jewelry, and I've never had this problem with them. So I just want to put that out there. But this one I was my problem. Okay, so we have one person saying, I have not had any good experience with Shop Goodwill either. I am done with them. Just don't like their business practice. That's too bad. I've had, like I said, I've had, you know, Mother's mustache said he hasn't either. Yeah, that's some cow poo, right? <laughs> or, or bull poo. Um, I agree. Like, I, so I'm just kind of, and every day I check back to see if they have sent a message. Um, and this has been going on for a while, and there's no more messages. So my thing is, I'm going on, well, like a mini vacation. Cedric has a doctor's appointment in most of you will know Fargo, which is about three hours from us, so we're going to stay over there. It's a bigger city for us, so we get to go eat some good food, like Red Lobster. And um, But uh, so for me, I'm just, if they haven't by Monday, I'm going to sort through that. I'm just going to claim it as mine. Others mustache. I'm a girl, by the way. Did I say he? I'm sorry. But I'd be pissed about my address here. That's what I thought. And like these people would like I would not want my address out there. I thought that was so like that like not okay. Oh, you guys know each other. Because you know Anna and how do you say your name? Hmm. I'm horrible with names and I'm gonna try it. I'll like butcher your name and I'll feel horrible. It was a good thing I was never like a teacher because I would be like horrible, like I'd butcher all the kids' names. Like I remember in school, we used to like sometimes a teacher would let us do roll like roll count or whatever. I I never ever ever wanted to do it. Yeah, good food like Red Lobster. <laughs> I, I know, okay, it's not like real food over the, like real real seafood, but for here, it's as good as we get. We don't have anything like that. So, yeah, it's funny. It's like we we'll, these are the places that I know for sure that we will. Ansley, Ansley, did I say it right? We know, do I've seen her, her on other people's channels, but I don't know that I've ever like talking talking to her. Ansley, did I say it right? Oh, thank you. Oh, good. Yay. So we'll eat at Red Lobster, and for sure we'll eat at Panda Express because Panda Express is my favorite and my kids love their orange chicken um and i'm trying to think where else we'll eat we might eat at olive garden and then i think there's a steak place over there that's really good and i love steak so i try to if i can find a steak place that my kids have stuff oh yeah, I think I remember seeing you in there, and I think I've seen you on some of the other shows, too. Um, but we've never, but thank you for subscribing. I appreciate it. I'm 
I know I love Panda Express. I don't see, I don't, I can't eat the, the orange chicken is a little too spicy, but I have my things that I like there. I love their noodles. So those are the places that, and I know for like most people are like, what? That's where you want to go. But we don't have any of that here. Like we don't have, we're in such a small town. So when they have a huge mall, here comes a cat. Hi. Well, come say hi to everybody. Come here. This is Morgan's cat. She's really picky. Picky, picky. Here she is. Here she is. This is Olive. This is Morgan's kitty. <laughs> oh, I'm a steak and potatoes girl. Like, that's what she's done with me. Oh, well, I appreciate that because some people don't <laughs> love my attitude. <laughs> and my attitude is, I was talking, she's not in here anymore, but Don, like, I've been recently having a couple, I lost a couple subscribers and I've had them kind of berating me, not just because of me, but because of some of the people in the chat and not liking how they were and not liking that I wouldn't um you know ban them from my channel or whatever but um this is my thing is i've had a rough life and i've had very a lot of sad and a lot of hurt and a lot of yucky things that have happened in my past and in my children's past um when i was not happy for a lot of my life and at different times felt suicidal and um, kind of lived a life just trying to die, really, like just to be honest. Um, and I picked a lot of bad relationships, a lot of bad men, um, used for a long time, like just really horrible things. And so for me, I'm the happiest and just I know who I am. I love myself. Um, that I've ever been in my life. And so I'm all about just being my authentic self. And some people like me and some people don't. Um, my friends, like in, like not just my YouTube friends, but people who have known me for a long time, like we all make jokes about like the one thing about me is that you either love me or you hate me because I'm brutally honest at all times. Like I just am who I am. And it's taken me a long time to get here. And the other thing is, is that I haven't had a lot of la like true laughter and true happiness. And so I'm all about jokes and having fun and living life to the fullest. And so, um, yeah, I mean, the people are no longer a part of this channel. One, some of them left and some of them I blocked and I just, yeah. But so I appreciate that. That means a lot. Um, Uh, Carly from a few of them. I'm not going to say who because I'm not going to do what they're trying to do to me. So they're out. They, they're they not here. They chose to left too. And that's okay because we're not going to all get along. Like that's the truth. I mean, what's so funny to me, honestly, is like the YouTube community, the reseller community, like there's some of them that you fit with and then there's some of them that you don't fit with. And I I feel really blessed to be a part of the one that I'm a part of right now. and. Um, I mean, we make jokes that we're the reseller mafia and it really isn't about like, you know, being mean to anybody, but it's just like, you know, we're a club that just fits and, um, we get to have fun and joke around and, you know, <laughs> I mean, it's just, I mean, to me that that's, it's probably people that we wouldn't normally like see and be like, oh, I want to go hang out with them. But then once we get to know each other, right, then we like become besties and like become a family. We're a family and um, it's been great for me. It's been great for my kids. Um, and so I treasure each and every one of you. I love meeting my subscribers. I mean, when I started this with my daughter a year ago, I think it was, 
we would thought maybe we get to a hundred. I never thought we'd be at three hundred, and you know, so this is all just bonus. That's how I look at it. So <laughs> I have some great friends that are protective, but Mother Mustache said, and no, Jackie. I'm gonna say Jackie said we're we'll kick them all. <laughs> we're gonna kick them all out if they're mean to me. Uh, and then Carla said, I love you. You're so sweet and light. I love honesty. I don't get when people aren't direct. Yeah. Uh, if, if you don't like me, then you don't like me. Don't pretend you like me or say horrible things about me. That's why I'm not going to say their name because I'm not going to be like that. And then Mother's Mustache said, it's all good. Everything will buff out. F them. <laughs> if they can't handle the reality of life, everyone does not have to like everyone. Thankful we are different. I agree. And then Barb said, we don't take ourselves too seriously. No, we don't. Like, there's a time and a place, and I know that. And then there's a time and a place where, like, my life is still hard. Like, there's still things that are hard about it. Yeah, F the haters. Um, there's days I want to cry. Like, there's days that it's it's hard to get through that day, you know, or... For a lot of different reasons. And so sometimes I just need to go laugh and I need to just like, and so that's what I have found with, you know, um, my group of friends and the people on here and just being able to go and tell some really bad <laughs> out of pocket jokes with no judgment. Um, so I appreciate that. You know, it's small things. Yeah, and then and then when you're live, right? So like on some videos when I'm live and I'm doing like showing things or if I have another person on my channel and I'm interacting with them, the live chat people don't realize like it's really, really difficult. Um and as you can see, like I make almost everybody a moderator just because like I don't want anybody to feel left out. <laughs> Like, that's really the truth. Like, if I have seen you on my channel for a while, I'll make you a moderator because, I, like, that, that was kind of, I think, how the reseller killer um, or the reseller mafia kind of got started was <laughs> because I was, like, making every, like, a moderator. And then, like, I'd be online forever, right? Like, this one it was, like, once you come in, you never leave. <laughs> oh. So I love all of you guys. I, I mean, it's it is what it is. Like, I I totally agree. Like, and not everybody's gonna like me, and not everybody's gonna like our channel. Not everybody's gonna love Morgan, you know. Um, and that's okay. Like, all I ask is, don't be like if you're joking. That's one thing, but don't be like cunning, like hurtful. And that's what I saw some people. You know, I'm glad they're not here because that's what happened. They started attacking people. That they didn't really know because they didn't like them and i'm just like that's not okay so yeah april got her lunch today <laughs> you've been watching for how long you finally got it <laughs> but all right i gotta clean up me and we're gonna, gonna go out to lunch i have an appointment this afternoon and then we got pick up sun um, but we're probably not like, I don't have anything else. Like that Those are our last two boxes. Um, I have some like secret stuff I got going on. So make sure on Thursday to check out, um, a video I'm going to be posting. Um, and so my skin isn't thick enough to have a YouTube channel yet. You gotta have a thick skin. That's, I'm learning that. Um, unfortunately you do but so check out that keep an eye out for that that should be posting thursday morning so please please if nothing else come and watch that video on on thursday um and then we we'll probably won't see us until we get back next week because we are going on our little mini vacation anytime for the rent thank you guys for watching love you guys so much Thanks for like hanging in there and remember you keep it real until I see you next time. Bye.